this one is an older one. Okay. Um, I'm not very good with the, like, goals, like follower goals, sub goals, that kind of stuff. I never know what to do for them. Um, I don't even know how to set it up on the channel to see it. I mean, uh, I'm a new... I'm... I'm... Ah, okay. But, point is, I was considering, um, some follower goals. And I don't know if they'd be a little, uh, much. Because I was thinking the goals would apply at, like, 600 is the next, like, basically would be the next kind of hundred that I get. So I was thinking 600 and then 750 and then maybe 1,000 uh, to set as follower goals. Um, and I was thinking, if anyone was interested, that uh, what I could do at, at those goals, um, I could set up a vote to stream... Uh, I could set up a vote to stream um, between a select small selection of games that are... Um, how do I put this? Uh, a little more um, risque than what I would normally normally stream. The, there are there are some games I have that I have basically never really considered streaming seriously because I know that they're a little, a, possibly a little bit fan servicey. Oh, such as? Um, well, I haven't really, I haven't drawn up a full list yet, but, I mean, out of selection of games I have, um, to start with, uh, Conception is one, um, Knights of Azure, or no, yeah, Knights of Azure is another one, um, Maid, Ye, Yeast. Uh, Conception, Knights of Azur, uh... I'd have to double check through my library, <laughs> but I do have some other ones. Oh, uh, uh, um, uh, bah, 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 bah. Mary Skelter, Mary Skelter kind of is a bit, uh, fan servicey. Hello, all. Hi, Clang. Wait, does she like hey, us? do you know anything about the Alexia Cave? What do you need to know? <laughs> Actually, yeah. I heard that a long time ago. The cave was full of mana. Oh? It's dangerous, though. You shouldn't go too far into the cave. Why is that? Well, there's more to the story. See, a fierce dragon once lived there. Oh, ads, damn it. Okay, no worries. The townspeople would offer young girls as a sacrifice to the dragon. Scary, huh? Hmm. I saw a strange door in the cave. Do you have a key for it? <laughs> oh, I do, but... You're not really planning to go inside the cave, are you? I'm not a young girl, so it should be fine. <laughs> oh, I mean, I guess that's one way to look at it. Oh yeah, there was this scary dragon, and the villagers would sacrifice young girls to it to appease it and keep it, uh, keep it at bay. Like, oh, you're not planning on going in there, are you? I mean, I'm not a young girl. I should be fine. Uh huh. Uh huh. Cl claim that that's that's not the best logic, claim. But all right. Back. Welcome back. And yes, that's an awesome idea. Well, thank you. All. <laughs> I I almost half guess that if I if I were to make up any kind of list, more than likely, uh. More than likely, I'm guessing Conception probably is going to win first. <laughs> oh my god. I, uh, that game. Uh, oh, oh. oh boy. 
I've never played the first one. I've played oh, some of okay. Conception 2, though. I can't say no to you, Clayne. Here's the key. Do, 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 do. Oh my. These games are voiced? Yeah. Well, not completely, but yeah, they have a lot of, um, a lot of scenes with voice acting. Which I appreciate, because then I don't have to try and make up my own voices, because I'm not that good with them. <clears throat> I love the PS1. This is a PS2 game, actually. Funny enough. Not sure which this is. Or two. Yeah. No, this is PS2. Um, unfortunately... Okay. So, unfortunately, um, with my current setup, I can't play any PlayStation 1 games unless they're, um, digitally off the PS3 or PS4, because then they've been, you know, ported and, uh, upgraded, I guess, to basically run off HDMI, uh, or component. Pixel graphics and CD, DVD sound. Yeah. Un unfortunately, yeah, I can't properly capture PS1. Yeah, this is actual capture, right? Yeah, yeah. This is, this is my PS2. Literally, uh, just my PS2 connected to my capture device. I can tell because of the interlacing. Interlacing? I don't know Come what on. that means. What what is what's interlacing? Eat this. Oh. Like motion lines. Oh. Okay. That's I all get for you. you. I see. I see. <laughs> no problem. Kind of like how like an old old NES game would look on like a CRT. This is a 480i game, as almost all work. Yeah. No, oh, yeah, you're absolutely right on that. This is 480i. Hmm. Put up the barrier. And the I mean interlace. Okay. Are we still stuck here and can't get past this? Here we go again! Vine trap. Great shot! Go for it, Lita. Yeah. God damn it, I can only get one of them. Time to go! Alright. Um, that was a nice workout. But yeah, no. Uh, the setup I have outright won't work with a physical copy of a PS1 game. I've tried it. I've used physical discs for PS1 in my PS2, and it just won't capture. It just won't. It won't. I'm assuming because they're not properly set to run through composite cable. Or is it component? Component cable? I can't remember if it's component or composite. Hmm. 
Either way, PS2 games will actually capture on my PS2. Are you using the yellow cable? Uh... PS1 are 240p, which would be why. Oh. Yeah, no, the, the cable I'm using is um, RGB and black, I guess. Well, technically, like, 256p. Oh, okay. Yeah, if you hook up via just the yellow, it may work. I'm... That's the thing. I don't think that's an option on my capture device. So I had to go with component cable. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm thinking now that I'm... Now that I'm actually thinking about it, I think it is component. Or yellow to green. Okay. Uh, wait. No, wrong way. God dang it. Ready? Okay. Guys, run. <laughs> the green input is usually the same sig... Green input is usually the same signal. Might be worth a shot. Okay. Well, I'll give it a look next time I get a chance. Um, But... I mean, otherwise, like, if it's... Ready? If if it is a digital version on PS3 or PS4, it works fine. And if it's, uh... I've tried it with the PlayStation... I do have a PlayStation Mini. Same signal as yellow and may capture correctly. Oh, okay. Just the yellow. Okay. Okay. I may give that a shot then. Um, because there are some PS1 games that I own in phys like physical copies of that I would love to actually um, try and stream or record sometime. Hi, V4. Hello. How are you? Oh, welcome in, V4. Like, how are you? B. <laughs> Are you ever gonna finish this? Wow, okay, V4. You're the one that requested I play this. Are you ever gonna finish it? Eventually, we're gonna finish it, V4. You knew this was a long game when you asked for it. Anyway, I've finished eating, so I must lurk or my brain won't be able to focus on packing. Yes, but you're not finishing this. Alright, Emmy, enjoy the lurk. Uh, good luck with the packing. Let's see what you've got. Mm, no, we're gonna run. Bye, bye. Stuff, stuff. <laughs> Get out of the way. Get out of the way. Get out of the way, rocks. Out of the way. Thank you. Out of the way. Ugh. Thank you. Enjoy the game. Oh, thank you. You're very welcome, Emmy. Want the final boss? Before. What? Okay.
barrier. <clears throat> I'd rather not get hurt by lava, please. Heal and save in here before I... Before we try this. Thanks for the heal. We'll save. Bingo, here we go. The key should work here. Go easy on it. That key looks pretty old. Mm. And it's open. <clears throat> oh, here we go. What? That... This is it. Was that... Did that just happen to time poorly, or? Okay, I'm guessing that was just coincidental. All right. the dragon look at that huh you seen one frozen dragon you seen them all <laughs> wow okay delsis all right i suppose that's the dragon from the legend poor bastard his own cave was too frigid for him i see nothing related to the eternal land of mana Relax. We just need to look around. Mm, meow, it's too cold. I can't even move. <laughs> oh. Well, hello. You're being raided by a bunch of silly knuckleheads. Oh my god. Well, hello. Welcome in. Uh, thank you for the... Welcome in, raiders. Uh, hello, Sandy AJ. You caught me pouring myself a drink. <laughs> hello, Sandy AJ. Hello, Zara Taro. Hello, K Palouche. Uh, hello, bearer of peace. <laughs> hello, raiders. Welcome in. Hi. Uh, okay, so, well, I am DZ, your overlord, Deseran, vampirous ruler of the netherworld Crimson Kiss, a world of perpetual night notions of blood, a vampire's paradise. Welcome on in. Today was my Koei Tecmo night, and I always raid someone playing one of their games. Zarataro recommended that I raid you. Aw, well, thank you. That's sweet. That's sweet of you. Uh, yeah, we are playing Atelier Iris Eternal Mana, the one of the first PS2 uh, Atelier games. Uh, technically, way back then, uh, this was put out by Gust and uh, published by uh, Nipponichi Software or Nipponichi Software America. Thank you for doing the uh, caster selfie. Knights of Azure. Oh. I've, uh, I've actually had that game, and Knights of Azure 2. I haven't gotten the chance to try them. Dang, what, how was it? What was Knights of Azure like? Did you have fun with it? <laughs> I kept getting lost in the subways. Oh, oh no. 
Oh my. Have you played, um, have you played my, any, have you, well, I shouldn't say any, but have you played the, uh, Atelier games at all? It's like slashy action plus demon Pokemon with Yuri girls. That's fair. That's very fair. Same thing happened in FF7 Remake as well. Oh no. Oh no. Oh my god. But yeah, no, welcome in. Uh, I do enjoy Koei Tecmo games. Ryza, Sophie, and Arlen so far. Ah, okay, okay. Uh, I do, I do enjoy Koei Tecmo games a fair bit. I... Oop. Uh, thank you for the follows, Capelouch and Sandy AJ. Welcome to the Demonic Army and being a denizen of Crimson Kiss. Thank you. That's all I need for a follow. Well, <laughs> Rise of getting an anime. Oh, well, that's sweet of you. Um, so I I do enjoy Koei Tecmo games. I have played a number of them. Um, Koei Love is definitely follow worthy. <laughs> um, now I will say my enjoyment of their games tends to be a little uh, a little bit of the different franchises um, like oh god let me even think here so on the Tecmo side specifically um, I love the Fatal Frame franchise Warriors um, I do have I haven't gotten to play many of the Warriors games um, I do have uh Samurai Warriors 4-2. And, uh, I do have... <laughs> okay, so this is where it's gonna get weird. I have, of all things, I have Dynasty Warriors Tactics for PS2. Um... <laughs> but, uh, strangely enough, instead of the Warriors games, I have more of the... I have the Kessen games. For PS2, if you know what I'm, the one I'm talking about. I have about 98 Koei Tecmo games so far. I did have that as well. Oh, okay. Yeah, I've got like Kessen one through three. Um, but I mean, I absolutely adore the Fatal Frame franchise, which is from Tecmo originally. Um, I love the Monster Rancher franchise. Yep, Kessen confused me with the Liu Liu Bei, the. Yeah. Da Liu Bei Dao Chan shipping. Oh my god. But yeah, no, Fatal Frame is basically my favorite horror franchise, so there you go. That's that's Tecmo right there. <laughs> I mean, there's basically, there's basically four, um, there, there's basically four publishers outside of just, like, Nintendo or something. There's four publishers that I absolutely adore and try to, well, some I keep up with more than others. I did try to play Maiden of Black Water tonight, but I chickened out when it came to going in the water under the dollhouse. Oh, I, I know the part you mean. I know the part you mean. I have, um... I've been there. I've done I've done playthroughs of all the Fatal Frame games. Um, the only one I haven't managed to actually do a playthrough of, and that's because it's a freaking it it's a 3DS game, is Spirit Camera. Unfortunately, I have no way to capture 3DS, and I don't want to emulate. So, uh, uh, no Spirit Camera, unfortunately. But I have done Fatal Frame 1 through 5, so... Including the, uh, the recent, um... Mask of the Lunar Eclipse. Which was 4, technically. I have that one on my 3DS as well. Not sure if it's worth mounting cameras to play. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no kidding. <laughs> um... But yeah, no, if, um... Basically, there are four... Well, hang on. Let me let me get them going again. 
basically there's four publishers that I will follow. Um, Koei Tecmo is one of those four. The other three are, well, there's Koei Tecmo, Atlas, uh, Idea Factory, and my, uh, my number one is Nippon Ichi Software, Nisa. Because, well, <laughs> I just love Nisa games, honestly. And, uh, considering they've worked with Koei Tecmo a number of times and Gust, you know, there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of back and forth. If, uh, if you've played any of the Nisa games, if you know the Disgaea franchise, uh, you might recognize me a little bit, because that's kind of what my... Well, that's what, kind of what my look is based on. I am an overlord, after all. Koei Tecmo, SNK, Capcom, Square Enix for me. Ah, Square Enix. Capcom, always fun. I do enjoy Resident Evil. Uh, I'm playing through Resident Evil 4 as well on streams. Uh, the remake. Uh, I've I have done a playthrough of the SNK 30th was it 30th anniversary collection? I think that's what it was, the SNK 30th anniversary collection. And I do have um, I have uh, uh, oh god, what's the name of it? Um, 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 um. Uh, SNK Heroines Tag Team Frenzy. <laughs> oh. As for Squeenix, well, I mean, obviously, Square. Working my way through all Ace Attorney games and each Metal Slug one. Ah, oh, okay. Oh god, lo oh god? What do you mean, oh god? What's wrong? What, 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 what's wrong? What's wrong with SNK Heroines? Gal Fighters was far better. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm not huge on fighting games to begin with, but, um... And I and I asked America did the collector's edition for that, so I mean, <laughs> I I have the the fatal cuties hat, um, among other things. <laughs> oh. oh my god. Uh, and funny enough, for Square, uh, the first PlayStation game I ever played was a Square game, and no, it wasn't Final Fantasy VII. Funny enough, the very first oops, Tag Team Frenzy was supposed to be a redo of Gal Fighters from Neo Geo Pocket, but they went weird with it. Oh, I see, I see. The uh, the gender bent Terry was a little much. Is that is that what I'm hearing? Maybe. <laughs> I did hear it's a little crazy. Oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my. Gal Fighters had the gender bent. Why is the ice melting, meow? Lori as the final boss. Oh, I see, I see. Okay. Wait. I'm sorry, what, Norn? Why is the else why is the ice melting? Ah crap, we're gonna have to fight a dragon, aren't we? <clears throat> yep. What's going on? Ah, crap. We're gonna have to fight a dragon. <laughs> 